Welcome, my peeps, my peoples. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video. It'd be greatly appreciated from the bottom of my heart, my peeps, my peoples. Peep squad is in a building, baby. We going to the top. We're going to bring others with us. So let's get it popping. Let's talk about Wendy Williams. So Wendy Williams, when she got on her TV show today, she announced that she's dating a 52-year-old man. And basically, he's fit, he's built, and he has adult children, and he looks good. And she ain't in love with him. But, you know, she's working her way to love. And his name is Darren Poacher. So basically, Wendy Williams staff, they was puzzled. They were blindsided. They had no idea that Wendy Williams was going to reveal today, July 8th, that she's actually dating, you know, this 50-year-old gentleman, you know, Darian Poacher. And so they're like shocked. They couldn't believe that Wendy Williams was spilling the tea. And it was like, wow, it's really going down. And it was just like, they were just so appalled and shocked too as well. Because they believed that Wendy Williams revealed that she was dating this 50-year-old man, Darian Poacher. Because, you know, she's in jeopardy of losing her show. Because her show is supposed to be renewed in 2020. And basically, the producers and also the network is not too happy with Wendy Williams' behavior. Because they feel like, you know, um, Wendy Williams is not setting a good image because she was running around town with Mark Tumbling and basically saying that he's a felon he has a criminal record you know he's bad news and there's stories out here about Mark that you know he's hum his homeless and you know he was hustling women out of their money this is alleged I don't know if that's true about Mark but Mark didn't say anything negative or bad about Wendy and he hasn't posted anything about Wendy so far and you know I you guarantee people tried to ask some questions and wanted to interview Mark but he has not said anything about Wendy Williams negative at all. So they're saying that there is a uh, morality clause in Wendy Williams' contract and her walking around with Mark tumbling and basically partying and looking like she possibly have been drinking that the network is basically ready to pull the plug on Wendy Williams. I was like, that could not be true. Why would they want to pull the plug on Wendy Williams? Like, damn, she's just living life. She's 50-something years old. She's starting over brand new. Let her be happy. Let her be with one young dude. She ain't even with him no more. Like, she was just having a good time. She just needed somebody to just, you know, hold her hand and be with her while she was going through a difficult time. You know, it, it was emotional. Yes, he's 27 he's too young but when as long as you're over the age of 18 you're not too young but you know what wendy williams statue and what she represents people are like oh no this guy's a felon oh he's no good she needs to stop it and all this other stuff about wendy williams so we're gonna see what's gonna happen with this situation because they're saying that they want to pull the plug on wendy williams i was like oh no and her staff members are saying that this was only a ploy to basically get the network and the executives okay with Wendy Williams and back in a good, you know, um, zone with her bosses because they were not feeling mock tumbling at all. And this is a better choice. I was like, OMG, like, damn, Wendy Williams can't do nothing. She can't live. Like, she can't have fun. She can't go out dancing. She can't, you know, ride around, eat mashed potatoes, eat potato salad, drink Coca-Cola. She can't do any of that without being judged to the fullest. And I know she has a reputation. I know she has a statue. I know people invest in her. And there's a lot built on Wendy Williams and people, you know, get their investments back by Wendy Williams going on the show and actually doing a good job on her show. The network, the executive, they get paid. You know, their ratings go up too as well. But can the lady live her life? Can she have a little fun? She talks about gossip all the time. She talks about relationship. Let her have a little bit of fun. Let her have a little bit of a relationship. So the story is, is that Wendy Williams' co-workers or people that work with Wendy Williams, her staff members, they believe that this relationship with Darian um, poacher is not actually true it's just an attempt to keep her job and and save her image because right now they're saying that her image is you know basically to the floor and it's under the dirt because of this young guy that she she was you know running around town with and they don't like the company that she's keeping like black china either so basically wendy can't really live her life like, what's going on? So what do you guys think about this situation? I'm like, whoa, I know everybody makes mistakes. And probably she was just having a good time and she was enjoying, enjoying her time with Mark tumbling and she probably felt some type of connection she just probably felt free and young and probably felt innocent and probably felt like i can do this again i have a young dude that's attracted to me that likes me i am beautiful i am special because she wasn't hearing that from her husband you know kevin hunter because he was out there having an affair on wendy williams for allegedly 15 years with sharina hudson so she was just having some fun and if 
her relationship with Darian Porcher, you know, maybe it will work, you know, but basically she's just dating. She's just trying to try things out. She probably really wants to just be alone, but she can't be alone because if she's alone, people are going to assume that she's back with Ke Kevin Hunter and then her ratings go down and then people write into the network and write into the, the executors and the producers of the show and the people that work at the network about Wendy Williams' relationship. We don't like this. We don't like that. Damn, it's so hard to please people. It's just so hard so maybe she is actually going to move to hollywood and start something over brand new and fresh let mm, mm, mm. i was just like damn they was like they were blindsided they had no idea that she was even dating this guy like she kept this on a wrap so the staff member believed that this is not true her relationship with darian Porcher. i believe it's true I hope it's true. You know what? Sometimes you got to fake it until you make it. And you know what? I really think something positive than think something negative. You know what I'm saying? So you guys tell me what you think about the situation. Peace. I'm out. Much love to all my peeps and my peoples. Peep squad is in the building, baby.